And I'm Katie Ben. Today, we have a special episode. It's a family episode. I called up my grandma and I was like, I need you to take a photo of food that you and Papa Denny made and send it to Wyatt so I can remake it. I am very nervous because if I don't get it right, I feel like I'll put shame to my family. <sighs> For this family episode, I am wearing my great grandma's earrings and rings. So you could also call me Auntie May. You can all be my nieces and nephews. So let's see which one she sent by it. I feel like, <laughs> I feel like I know what this is, knowing my grandma. I think it's, um, a like cheeseburger crescent roll thing. And I think it's just gonna be like ground meat in crescent rolls and that's it. <laughs> we are gonna mix that meat with these seasonings. I just wanna do a shout out to Danielle because she bought me mixing bowls. So Visual Cookie now has mixing bowls. <laughs> I also want crack a cold one for Papa Denny. I also want to point out this is Miller and that's from Wisconsin and I'm from Wisconsin. Okay, so we got our meat. Look at this meat. Okay, let's season this. Cumin? And then you just gotta like put it down because you just gotta like hit it because it comes out really slowly and we ain't got time for that so we got the cumin in there fun fact if you want to make your own taco seasoning cumin is like the number one ingredient so some cayenne pepper my grandparents actually used to have a dog named pepper in case you were wondering i just added garlic obviously we're gonna add some cilantro nature seasoning another shout out to papa denny then we gotta add our favorite ingredient, ladies and gentlemen. Salt! All right. Now we're gonna take our handies and just put it and mix those ingredients together. And uh, we mixed it up with the ingredients and now we're gonna wash our hands again because we're not gonna cross contaminate. Very important. We mixed it, our meat, we mixed the meat, put it in the pan, and we're gonna cook it. When you see it next, it'll be cooked. So, we're gonna put this together. And, uh, do you hit these? I think you just hit these to open them, right? Nope, that's not it. What says peel it? I peeled it. Oh, it just popped on some. It's so hot here that in the time it took us to go to the store to get back, and I put it in the fridge as soon as we get, it's just like sticky and gross. So I'm gonna make a little circle. Oh my God, this is hot. We just bought this. Delicious. Overlap them a little bit. And we're gonna put the meat in. I added onions to this meat. I don't know if that's what's actually in it, but I like onions, so I'm gonna do it. Really. <laughs> Preheating my oven at 400 degrees. So it's already hot here, and we're making it hotter in my house. Spooning this in, I don't really wanna overfill it. I also only made a pound of meat, so. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna add cheese. And knowing my grandma, she probably used a lot of cheese. We're from Wisconsin, so it's a dairy state. We use a lot of cheese and things. Roll, roll them up, I guess. And this dough is so warm. Look, this is awful. There's like no form to it. 
Well, I'm gonna wash my hands and put this in the oven. So it's done. So I have these, um, I don't know what you want to call them, pot holders that my great grandma Cossack made herself. So we're just doing all the family today. Here it is. Okay, here we are. Everything is done. It's the time you've been waiting for. It was flaky. go. Looks really good and really hot. And I don't know how I want to eat it. Also, I probably cooked it a tad too long. Sorry. That's really good. Okay. I'm going to see you guys later. I'm going to eat this whole thing myself. This is the recipe. Are you ready? One pound ground beef, one onion, one packet taco seasoning, one cup cheddar cheese, and two tubes of crescent rolls. Guess who was correct? I knew that my grandmother would make beef. The ground turkey was buy one get one free, so how can I pass that up? And I also make my own taco seasoning. But otherwise, I nailed it. That, that's it. Follow me, subscribe, like this video, show it to all your friends. That was this episode of Visual Cooking. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share with your family, because it's a family episode, y'all. I'll see you in two weeks.